And we are back here on the WHHI TV Daily News. With me now is John Troyer, and he is the Director of Finance for the town. Welcome. It's nice to see you. It's great to be here. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so we passed the budget last week, which yes. is always a nice thing to check <laughs> off the to-do list, right? That's been in the process for a long time. So let's talk a little bit about that process. Sure. It started back in January. The town council had a strategic planning workshop back in January to, to determine the priorities for the town. And starting with that and then proceeding to uh, work, uh, meetings with the departments and uh, gathering together the priorities of the town culminated in uh, the, the affirmative budget vote. So the budget passed last week and so we're excited about that. Yeah, it is exciting. And I think one of the things that it's, that's exciting, at least for citizens to find out is, and they've been talking about this, but now it's official, mm -hmm. that property tax rates are not going to go up. That's right. They passed the budget at the same 23.1 mills, and it'll be rolled back for reappraisal when those numbers are finalized. Okay, so but that's always good news. We yes, like we like it news. when taxes don't <laughs> don't go up. Um, and then you mentioned before we started filming, there's a lot of capital projects in there. So let's talk about a few of those. Certainly. Um, the beach program has some attention to all the beach parks, and so um, uh, you should have seen some work already, and there'll be more this year. Um, just an update for all of um, all across the island pathway program there's funding in there for improvements to the pathways all across the island and so there's something for anyone if you're enjoying the pathways um, they're going to be better um, our roads whether it's William Hilton Main Street Squire Pope um, there's improvements there intersection improvements and so I, I think that's uh, just know that those um, improvements are are funded and will happen um, exciting is our parks. We've got Chaplin, Crossings, Shelter Cove, and more. Right. And so the town council has, has really made a priority for investment in the parks, and this budget certainly reflects that. Um, we'll have um, some money for Coastal Discovery. Um, what a great community asset. Yes. And some money for Historic Mitchellville. Okay. And so, so we'll, you'll see some improvements there. We're always happy to do what we can for them. Our fire department will get um, an, uh, a new fleet and so we'll have some new fire trucks on the island and oh, so you'll great. most certainly see them uh, deployed and across um, serving the public and a little bit of money for land acquisition so town council has made a couple of uh, uh, land purchases here recently and there's some money in the budget to do some more research about um, uh, some options they might consider in the future. Um, beyond that, I think there's a couple of things. There's a Gullah Geechee Historic Neighborhood Community Development Corporation, right. brand new, never been in the budget before. And so it, it was exciting for the town council to be able to fund this initiative and put it as a separate fund, as a priority for our community. Yeah, well, it sounds like you're hitting on all the points that people would, I think, think important. You know, preservation of our mm -hmm. history, expansion of the parks, you know, maintaining the roads and the pathways, those are all great. When the mayor was here last week, he talked about the acquisition that was once Cracker Barrel. Mm -hmm. And so that's kind of speaks to those things where obviously it was land acquisition, but then that's also going to be part of the park system now. Absolutely. And so that's going to be something that residents can enjoy, visitors can enjoy. Um, and also a, another initiative that's in the budget is some housing funds so that um, whether it's workforce or affordable housing, um, town council has been working really hard on that and they've put some some money to back it up to try to help our community. Yeah, and of course that is a hot topic that's been one for quite a while, so it'll be good to see that moving forward. Yes, yeah. absolutely. And so the North Point is uh, moving forward and um, it, that's, that's you'll see that very, very soon. And then the budget will include money beyond North Point. What are we going to do after that? And yeah. so we're excited to share that. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for all your hard work and the, all of the council's hard work in getting this passed. We appreciate it. And thank you for sharing with, with us what was in it. Okay. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. And we'll be back with more. So stay with us.